Well, I had the uh, real good luck using the autumn olive for my bow drill. And um, last time I was out in the wet weather practicing making a bow drill fire after some heavy rains, I forgot my bow in the woods. I left it. I made a good 10 fires with that bow and I'm kind of bummed out. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and try and make another one using uh, all the same components. Uh, this time I'm using box elder. This is all box elder that I found in the woods. And I'm going to make the bow, the spindle, and the fireboard. And I think I'll probably stick to using my oak bearing block. That thing still seems to be holding up fairly well. I'm not sure what's going on. These sirens have been going off for the past 15 to 20 minutes. So I wanted to try out my new uh, 550 cord, paracord, that I got when I was at the Army Surplus store the other day. I was shopping around for a new backpack and they really didn't have what I was looking for. Uh, but they did have 550 cords, so I went ahead and got some of that. I've I've never had this before, but so far I really like it. It does seem to tangle up easy if you just coil it up like you would a normal rope. And I saw, once again, IA Woodsman had a video and he showed a daisy chain. It's just an easy way to keep your cord in line and keep it from getting tangled. So I went ahead and gave that a try and it seems to work really good. Uh, not sure how well it will do for cordage for the bow drill but I will find out here. So let me go ahead and get all these components together and I'll give it a go.